Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you a simple eyeshadow look using the Morphe 350 palette. So if you guys want to see how I got this look, keep watching. Now to prime my eyes, I'm going in with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Just going to prime my eyelids and prep it for my eyeshadow. So the first color I'm using is this light orange eyeshadow. I'm just going to use a regular blending brush and apply that slightly into the crease of my eyelid. I'm making sure to just keep blending that eyeshadow in and then I'm going in with this reddish orange shadow. I'm going to apply that slightly on top of that uh, lighter orange and a little bit below that and just dragging that back and forth into my crease. So making sure that I blend that into my crease, I'm going to go ahead now and take this light champagne color. I'm going to apply that to the center of my lid, just making sure to pack that on. Once that eyeshadow is in, I'm going in with this dark uh, matte brown. I'm going to go ahead and sketch out the outer corner of my eyelid just to kind of give it a little bit more of a smoky effect. And you'll see that I'm kind of going in between brushes because I'm trying to blend this perfectly the way that I like. So I'm going to go switch back and forth between brushes just to make sure that every time I put on a new shadow or a new shade or a new color, I'm going to go ahead and blend that in. And I, at this point, I kind of decided I didn't want it to be too dark. So I went back in with that dark orange, like burnt red, and applied that over that brown. Now I am going to go ahead and highlight my brow bone, my brow bone using that color. So I'm going to apply a little bit of that right underneath my arch and blend that in. And forgot to show you that I use this really soft taupe color as a transition color. And I also use that to kind of blend the um, eyeshadow, the brow bone highlight, and the darker orange together. I'm going to reapply a little bit of that champagne color just because I feel like I lost some of that color payoff. And then I'm going in with these lashes. They're from the Juvia's Place. And I'm just using my Velour Lash Glue. Once I have my lashes and my wing liner on, I'm just going to go ahead and line my bottom waterline using Max um, eye, eye Pencil and Feline. So you guys already know I'm just going to go ahead and repeat those same colors I used on my eyelid to my lower lash line. I'm going to use that darker brown and smoke that out. And now I'm going to take that uh, burnt orange eyeshadow and apply that right below the brown just to give it a nice transition effect. Alright, so moving on from the eyes, I'm going in with my ever, ever so trusty CoverGirl Queen Ebony Bronzer. I'm going to use that to contour my face and fix my camera a little bit. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and contour my face with that. Once my face is contoured, I'm going in with my uh, Real Techniques contour brush and I'm using my Mario Badescu Rose Water and I'm going to spray my brush and then dip it into my ColourPop Wisp highlighter and apply that circular motion just to give myself a soft glow. So 
So yeah, at this moment I realized I did not set my face with my powder. So I'm going to take my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish and just literally just lightly dab this and press this into the areas of my face that I didn't highlight. For my lips, I'm going to go ahead and use Max Lip Pencil in the uh, color Cork. I'm just going to line my lips. And for my lipstick, I am using Max Lipstick. I believe this is Dress to Thrill. I can't remember, but I'll have it in the description bar below. That's going to be my lipstick choice for today. I thought it was really soft and simple and went with the eye look. And I am setting my face with the Scandinavia uh, Makeup Finishing Spray. And that is going to complete our look, honey. So I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Please don't forget to like, thumbs up, and share. And if you're not subscribed, please do so. And I'll see you all in the next video. Right I saw him a little bit. She's gonna walk right up into my YouTube. You're gonna be on YouTube, bitch. Keep walking. You're gonna be on YouTube, bitch. Keep walking. Keep walking up in here. Oh my god. Okay. Keep walking up in this camera. You're gonna make your debut.